In today's video, we are going to be looking at some few reviews on what we have done so far. I'm sure as a DJ, you, are, you cannot just be doing things and just be pumping energy out there even as you progress in your career without really looking at some certain things that you have done over the period of time. Guys, so I keep a record of everything you are doing is very very important. However, on this particular video, we are going to be reviewing a little things from this very channel. To see the kind of things we have worked on over a period of time you get to appreciate what i'm doing here by the end of this video the essence of this information is not just for you to just watch it's for you to actually have a well organized information because the entire essence of any information you are going to be getting on the internet if it is not organized you can actually not make anything tangible out of it that is why a lot of people will have a problem with this internet space especially when it comes to learning they are confused you have truckload of information but body you left right center at the end of the day you are lost you don't know where exactly you are going to so let's go over to the channel now to get to see so far what we have worked on i believe as a dj you to get to appreciate the entire essence of what you are doing here and you also put that effort to also improve what you are doing as well as you progress in your career from the start we looked at how to transition using cue points you can actually see it down here you can see it I think that one also have a mapping for it, which I was on, out there on my online store. We look at conga drums, and then we we'll look at the difference between the different the two major drum sounds that I have out there. Look at it, the JK Wise and the Jelawi. There are other ones that are coming. How to download it? Finger drumming, music distribution. You can see. So there's possibility that you must have skipped one or two of this information. You can see. Most of others, how to make money online with your content. That means as a DJ. So I wouldn't go in detail, I have more coming. You can see how to make perfect playlists for your DJ mixes. You see, this is not just random information, they are information that you really need to take time to look at. You can see how to set up sampler as a DJ. How do you how do you set up all these samples for your DJ mixes to ensure that you get the very best out of it? You can see sound effects, you can see stop scratches and stop transition. How do you go about it? This video capture everything. You can see a host of other ones again. Best sound effect. You see how to perfectly look like a pro. How do you do that? And you can see some hosts of other things I'm also working on. So you can see how to freestyle scratch. You see how do you really freestyle, especially on a cappella? You can you get to see it in this video. How do you set your cue point? And then how do you set perfect stab scratch and the rest of the even cue scratches and the rest of them? How do you set up your drum samples? You can see it's a well structured information. How do you set up complex scratches and the rest of them? Then how do you set up your hot cues as you progress? How do you arrange your drum samples? How do you arrange your drum samples and then make the necessary corrections in terms of error? How then we look at the best uh, sound uh, mapping for your DJs? Then the difference between BPM and uh, beat per minute. So you can see setting cue point, jumping between cue point, your mic and your devices, your blending your back spinning effects and the rest of them skins how to blow count uh, rhythms and blues how do you count beats in rhythms and blues then your finger drumming virtual dj user interface so you can see the information is best settings mark uh, errors to avoid how to become a better dj then by the time you continue you see we talk about harmonic mixing and the rest of them 
then we also look at how to perform chop scratch then you can see harmonic mixing here a much more detailed video then your eqs and your equalizers are also there these are things you cannot avoid your filters your acapellas you can see when you are talking about, about a acapella remember your equipment sometimes might not give you the kind of result you want when it comes to acapella but this particular effect will give you a very much more better performance then you look at how to group your echoes how do you play around with your echoes how do you also beat match effectively how do you count your beat per minute this video is another video of its own that i believe if you watch this video you will believe what you really know about what you initially know about beat per minute you will see that you are having a completely different idea about it then the internet space has understanding virtual dj from the internet for your virtual keyboard keyboard then perfecting your mark your mixing in this video i explain my keyboard mapping and how you can get the very best while putting it to use then dj mixing with matching errors and then you can see how to transition using scratches errors keyboard mapping for scratches we look how to set up drum samples in different devices we look at record box serato softwares and the rest of them party time how to scratch and bit match another basic foundation so there are so much acid pro i'm going to be having a material for those who are interested in acid pro you have to watch out for this recording your dj mixes how to add some effect look at music is noise combining bricks and the rest of them then your scratches on controllers then how to play drums combining them performing a transformer scratch you can see so much on the channel you can actually see another loops and chords drums part how to switch between drum parts shortcut for smooth smooth transitioning and even keyboard shortcut for other stuff you can see harmonic mixing in another level you can see practicing your challenge finger drumming practice challenge that you have to be mindful of then how to go about other aspects when it comes to djing on the keyboard you can see we also look at the magic behind transitioning you can see then control base you can see virtual dj scratch on another level you can see here we look at how to set up your drum part or finger drumming and other stuff you can see becoming a successful dj then we look at how to become a successful dj without investment look at it you get to see how you build your career without really spending much then how to start then you look at how to invest your money wisely to make sure that you become a successful dj at the end of the day then we look at how best you can play your finger drum very fast then how to start on equipment with your equipment how do you go about it also look at serato dj and the rest of them so i believe if you can take time to go through this you see that you have really gathered a lot of information that will really help you equip yourself and we are going to be pumping in i'm going to be bringing in more concepts and more ideas on how you can better perform your skills as a dj so for watching this video to this very point i'm giving you a simple bonus offer that if you are interested in getting a logo for your dj or for your purpose of branding as someone who really don't joke with branding a lot your logo and other sound effects please let me know at the comment section of this video i'm going to be giving you for free that is the handsome reward you are getting for this watching this video to this very end so just drop your dj name and be rest assured you are getting it from me thank you for being there once again and catch you in my next video as we continue to bring you more value more entertainment and more high on demand skill that will really help you to become a successful DJ at the end of the day. You have every reason to be grateful that you came across the channel. So thank you once again for being here. This is actually to ensure that you continue to enjoy the very best from me and as you progress in your DJ career. Thank you once again.